Uh, I've been involved with the arts ever since I was a child, so it's been with me all my life. And um, from painting and oil paintings before, about when I was 13 years old, I started seriously painting. And it stuck with me through college, and I've made my, my career art. Well, um, my uh, uh, interests have always centered around uh, art and art history, and, and um, my dad was in the Air Force, so we traveled around a lot. And one of my great refuge, a uh, place where I would find refuge was in art museums, and um, that and libraries. So the, the two combined into a lifetime fascination with art and history. Walking down the street and just seeing, uh, you know, uh, uh, some moss on the sidewalk that looks beautiful, or or the, um, you know, the the look of a, a of a of a person who's wearing a beautifully colored outfit. Uh, uh, it can come from anywhere. It really can. Um, yeah, and inspiration comes to you. You don't go out and look for it. it no, you won't find it. I noticed that a lot of things are very, very, um, it looked like they've been produced by a machine, very digital. And digital is great, but it's only a tool. And we, all of the work that we've done um, in this new program is to uh, start by doing it the old fashioned way, doing it by hand and uh, painting our designs, uh, drawing them, uh, doing everything by hand, and then feeding it into a computer. And the computer and the digital uh, uh, process allows us to do repeats and everything that were, uh, frankly, a kind of a, a, a pain before. But um, we we want to reintroduce sort of a handmade uh, hand. The human rock, element. The human element, exactly. Thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, has to be in it, and uh, I think it makes for a richer, um, more uh, satisfying uh, look. 